to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to join our client OS or the our client machine to our domain controller, which is Windows Server 2016. So here you can see uh, the I have already installed the ADDS and the DNS services here and in our domain controller and I, I already promoted our server to domain controller and now I will join this Windows client to this Windows Server 2016 so first uh, what we need to do is first check your IP address in my PC I have given the 192.168.1.10 and uh, in our client OS we need to give that address as a gateway default gateway address in ipv4 so double click here in ipv4 and provide the that ip address as a default gateway one dot uh, which is one dot ten okay and hit okay and give the DNS as the same IP address 192.168.1.10 okay then hit the OK after changing our network setting try to ping that server to just make sure that we are already connected okay i am getting the response means we are on the same network we change the dns and default gateway because we want to ping our server with the fully qualified domain name that's why we need to add our DNS name, our DNS ID there. So now, go to in your my computer. On uh, right click on the this PC or my computer. Go to properties, and then here you can see the change setting here. Click that link and here you can see that to rename this computer or change the domain or work group click change so click the change button we can give this name pc name like pc1 and go to in a domain our domain name is land.com so and hit the ok button and here they you need to enter your credential admin credential of your domain hit ok and then see you will get the message like welcome to that land.com domain so login as other users and you, you can see sign in to LAN means our PC is already connected to LAN so LAN slash administrator and the password okay so let's try to ping our pc 192.168.10.11 it's getting the transmission failure why let's see what's the problem here My IP address is 1.11 and I, I typed like 10.11 so that's a problem 1.11 and
one dot ten. Okay, I can ping my server, but I am not able to ping this PC. Why? Let's try one more time. Okay, maybe my firewall is up. Okay, the problem is here is you can see in the domain network our firewall is on so we need to turn off that firewall in order to ping and communicate with PC so hit ok so now I turn off the I have turned off the firewall now we are able to ping that PC yes so we can ping our PC and we can ping our PC by its fully domain name pc one dot land dot com okay so this is our client PC which is connected to our server via domain controller So here you can see that we can ping our PC by using the fully qualified domain name which is PC1 means the our computer name and the our domain name which is line.com. So this is how you join your client OS2 server. Thanks for watching. If you like my video then give a thumbs up and if you have any questions then give a comment. Thank you for watching.